On the south side of Chicago, in the city's most dangerous neighborhood of Inglewood, brazen criminals occasionally hit a gangster's jackpot, shiny new guns in transit inside a sitting train car. Anytime you have individuals who are able to go into a rail yard and steal guns from a train, um, that makes the environment very toxic. The ATF says since 2013, more than 150 guns were stolen from freight trains. In one instance, thieves got their hands on more than 100 new Rugers. Some were traced to violent crimes, only a handful recovered. How in the world are these kids getting all these guns? And I see them on Facebook. I see them, everybody got guns. They, they can't go purchase a gun, so where are they getting them from? In a city where thousands of guns are recovered every year, 150 guns might not seem like a concern. But the ATF says a single gun in Chicago can be linked to a staggering 14 deadly shootings. Critics argue the Norfolk Southern Railway is to blame, saying it could increase security to protect the freight. And there are concerns for even worse scenarios. We need to be concerned about terrorists who can get into these areas unprotected and steal explosive and things that could very well damage our communities. Norfolk Southern tells Fox it's fully liable for stolen property and is working with all levels of law enforcement to increase security around its tracks. A bit of reassurance for neighbors trying to keep guns out of the hands of criminals in one of America's deadliest neighborhoods. It only compounds the, the, the damage that is being done to our city. Norfolk Southern says it's increasing its surveillance, canine units, and confidential security measures around its most targeted rail yard. And we saw some of that throughout our reporting. In Chicago, Matt Finn, Fox News.